The Russians, and in many ways the Chinese as well, are able to outrange most of our artillery systems. That harsh assessment was announced by General John M. Murray, the first head of Army Futures Command, in a conference held in 2018 at the Association of the U.S. Army Conference in Washington, D.C. The U.S. was falling behind its Cold War adversaries in the artillery department, not just by range, but overall firepower. As far back as 2015, American military studies showed that the Army had to develop a new generation of artillery to catch up with the latest Russian and Chinese arsenal. And so the U.S. Army's Extended Range Cannon Artillery System, simply known as ERCA, was born. Using an innovative artillery shell called Excalibur, this colossal new artillery weapon has enough power, speed, and accuracy to hit a target from 43 miles away. This is the equivalent to striking Washington, D.C. from Baltimore. If deployed, the new system could substitute the USAF's close air support role for ground troops, effectively changing U.S. tactics for future operations. During a 2018 conference, General Murray revealed the Next Generation Russian Warfare Study, in which the Army analyzed its Eastern European competitors' military capabilities and performance in Ukraine. Murray conducted that the study was the, quote, wake-up call for us to start looking at this in a more serious manner. According to Murray, the Army had discovered it was falling behind the increasing range of Russian and Chinese rocket systems. As in the Cold War epoch, when the power balance constantly shifted between the U.S. and the USSR, the Russians had the advantage in the rocket department. As Murray said, it was time for the U.S. to retaliate with better technology. The Army's extended range cannon artillery system, created as a direct countermeasure to Russian artillery superiority, broke records during its initial testing in 2019, hitting targets from up to 38 miles away. Although the extended range cannon artillery system is still under development, it reached a new record on December 19, 2020, when it hit a target from 43 miles away at the Yuma Proving Ground in Arizona. Brigadier General John Rafferty of the U.S. Army, in charge of the ERCA system, told reporters and media outlets, quote, I don't think our adversaries have the ability to hit a target on the nose at 43 miles. The standard M109A7 pallet and self-propelled howitzer can send rounds up to a maximum of 24.4 miles. ERCA effectively doubles that range. If implemented correctly, the Army expects the cannon to take out targets from a position currently out of range for enemy systems. The ERCA cannon is equipped with a 30-foot M109A7 Paladin Integrated Management Howitzer chassis. Its 58 caliber gun tube replaces the 39 caliber tube used nowadays by other U.S. artillery. According to Kyle Mizakame from Popular Mechanics, this longer barrel allows, quote, expanding gases triggered by the shell powder to act upon the projectile for a greater period of time, increasing velocity. To further increase the howitzer range, the cannon fires GPS-guided Raytheon-made Excalibur munitions using supercharged propellant. This barrel and rounds combination further increases artillery ranges and firepower, with an estimated fire rate of three rounds per minute. Future modifications include a fully automated MO loading system that will triple the fire rate at 10 rounds per minute. As part of the tests, the Army took three shots to study the round's range and power. The first shot came up short for high winds at a high altitude, failing the target by 300 feet. But considering that the round had to travel almost 23,000 feet, the shot actually landed very close to the target. The second shot had a hardware malfunction, and the third shot hit the mark successfully. General Murray of Army Futures Command said to news outlets that the U.S. Army is seeking a strategic cannon that can effectively fire on enemy positions as far as a thousand miles away. In an interview with Ariana Pulwick from Military.com, he said, quote, We are looking very hard and starting down the path of hypersonics, and also looking at what we call the strategic long-range cannon, which conceivably could have a range of up to a thousand nautical miles. In March of 2020, when news about the ERCA first surfaced online, Russian newspaper Izvestia reported that the armed forces were developing a new rocket artillery shell that would increase the range of the 2535 to 60 miles. Currently, 
the Russian 2535 Koalitsia, or Coalition, a 152mm self-propelled howitzer, has a maximum range of 49 miles, similar to that of the American M109A7 howitzer. However, to this day, not much information is known about this prototype, but in what many believe to be a second arms race reminiscent of the Cold War epoch, it may be true. <laughs>